So, I wanted to have this video come out like a month ago, uh, but I forgot about it. Uh, this was supposed to come out at uh, like early March. Um, so, probably January, February, I started this cycle of Anvil in Cyrodiil. It's the, it's the Dark Brother expansion. But to get the Thieves' Castage, to get the things I'm showing off, the Thieves' Chests that can spawn, you need the expansion that gives you the Thieves' Guild. Once you have both of them, you can do this. Um, your cheapest way of getting both DLCs is if you look up uh, Elder Scrolls Online Gold Edition. Um, it was a, I have two copies of the gold edition because of that. It gives you the first four DLCs, which include these two, the Imperial City, and then the, one of the bigger areas. I can't think of what it's called right now. Uh, it gives you all those and the Elder Scrolls Online. Uh, your best way of doing it is look up on GameStop or Walmart or something like that and buy the copy or amazon amazon has it too buy the copy of the game uh brand new um for like ten dollars and you get all four dlcs or you spend forty dollars and you buy each of the dlcs uh so whichever one is um damn it i was not supposed to grab that um I was supposed to wait until i was in the other area whatever um yeah so it's been about a month um, this should came out at least two weeks ago because it took a week and a half to get one of these chests. So right now, in this town, with the thieves stashes, and it's down below. If you want, just skip to them. I have found nine thieves stashes around the town, and three fake walls, two loose stones, and one loose panel. Um. And if you wanted to reset them or have a chance of, for them reset, you could back out of the game, like fully log out and then wait a minute or two and then log back in or wait a couple minutes and log back in. And you have a chance of a couple of them respawning. I've done that once or twice before. Um, but yeah, this is going to be a video showing off where all nine are in three panels. If you guys know of any other location in town, in Anvil, um, in the town of Anvil, uh, that has more thieves stashes like if I missed one or if there's more loose panels tell me because I will come back through I will spend as much time as possible to get them to spawn and I will put them in a combined video because my goal to is eventually when I have more free time is to go through Kavach and do the same thing look for loose panels and thieves stashes where they can spawn uh, like I said this is about a month month and two weeks of grinding to find all the thieves stashes and loose walls i found so far in anvil um and that is a lot of me just signing in did my give my dailies level up my horse up here uh, up at the north and then just running around and seeing if thieves stashes are there uh, my guess is there's probably 10 thieves stashes but knowing how they do it there's probably only nine because of reasons uh, but yeah, nine thieves ashes, three fake walls. Otherwise, hope you guys do enjoy the video. Like I said, I split it up down below. Uh, if you guys find anything else or find any more thieves stashes or anything in the town of Anvil, or if you know for some for Kavach, tell me because Kavach will be the next town I want to try to hit and see if I can find all or if not most of them. Otherwise, I will see you guys at the end of the video when we do the outro. Hello YouTube, this is Miss Grizz again. So, so far in Elder Scrolls Online, in this is the Gold Coast, this is the Dark Brotherhood expansion. Uh, they, once you join the, which one is it? Uh, give me a second. Once you join the Thieves Guild from the Thieves Guild expansion, you can find find their keepers, thief stat uh, throughout uh, th troves, and they give you a bunch of items that you can sell. So I usually do a route around in Anvil because I have found 
eight thieves thro- uh, throws or thieves chests. I would just call them chests from now on. I've I, I found eight around this area. There might be more, but I've been doing this farming camping spot for about a month, and I have found eight, and I found three uh, fake walls. So the first one, uh, we're at the gate right here. Uh, you can go level up your horse right here. Uh, I usually do that daily. Um, it is right by the blacksmith over in this back corner. Before I open up, I'll show you right here. Here is the first one. We got a large shipment. I'll open that elsewhere. And what? Let me see. Like I said, um, I found eight. There might be ten here. That is my guess, but I've only found eight so far. This video might be updated if I find a ninth or tenth spot. So, another spot. If the thing isn't here, we'll come back and show it later. But you just travel up the road a little bit. And over here on this ledge, uh, in this back corner, can appear a thieves stash. Here's number two. Wow, we got another large shipment. Number two, I didn't show you, but it's right there on the map. That's really good. Okay. I was going to revive him, but whatever. Okay. Third location. So behind the building here in town. You could go around the back side, doesn't matter. Uh, but back here, by this tree, behind here, a thief's dash can spawn right here on the ground. When I find it and I sh pop it up, I'll show you, but it's going to be right here. Oh, here's number three. This is about the uh, hour after we got number six to spawn. So it spawns right back here by the tree. Um, uh, just be wary of the guy there. You can kill him. Or you can just grab it if you go around the tree. That's number three. When that pops up, I'll do a video uh, of me opening it. Uh, number four uh, appears right here. There might be already a video about this if I want to do, do my own. I don't, like I said, found eight of them. Uh, about a month of running around. Uh, fourth one can spawn right here behind the well. All right, here's number four, the one behind the well. Finally showed up. Just be careful when you're picking that one up. Because Number five and six are outside of the wall here. So uh, before that, before we grab five and six, uh, on this wall here, on the side of the house here is a loose stone. One of the fake walls is right here. Same thing with these. I found three, but there might be more here. Um, so if people do find more, tell me because I'll... Okay, so... Yeah, so if people find more um, wall stashes, I know of three in here and eight thieves uh, stashes, then if possible, I might up upload a new video showing off even more here, or I will delete the original video and I'll put out one that has all the new locations added on. So number five for the stashes camp here over by this rock here, just outside the gate right here. Well, I didn't expect this, but this is chest number five uh, right here. Uh, like I said, just be careful when you're opening this because sometimes there's an NPC that walks over here. Um, this one I found probably a week ago. Uh, number six is if we keep heading through around this wall here. It's between these buildings here. It'll be in this corner here, but sometimes there's a... This is about 12 hours later. This is where number six is, like I was showing you. There's six right here. This is where number six is. Like I said, just between these two buildings, it can spawn here. Be careful, there's an NPC that walks from here to here, to this corner. So I'll pick this up quickly before they can come, but we'll just quickly show. Uh, so just be careful because she will sit down right there and she will see you if you try picking the stuff up from it npc that walks around here so number five is right here or number six i mean sorry 
That's number six. Um, like like I was saying, uh, that one, that one I found I take two days ago. Um, when I'm recording this, I'm recording this on a Monday. I don't know if this will be released on Monday. Probably not. Um, because it's probably gonna take a few days for those two pop up. Okay, so we're gonna grab. Okay, number seven. Back behind these buildings is a well. If you come up here and look down, in these bushes will be another thieves' hash. Here's number seven. Like I was saying, it is right here by the bushes. Like I said, when I find it, I'll insert it here. We're gonna grab wall, uh, loose stone number two, which is right here. Just right across from where the chest is. That's actually pretty good. Um, okay, number eight. And the final th the thief stash I found so far, like I said, this video will be updated if I find more. Um, is in this corner. It's just on the other side of the building in this corner here. I can spawn right here in the bushes. Here's number eight. Like I was saying, right on the other side of where number seven was. Right here. Which is actually going pretty well because... Uh, I'll tell you when I first started doing this loop um, I would go on level up the horse uh, Steal a bunch of stuff and then sell it. I only knew of two stashes at the beginning of last month and now I know of eight and the final uh, Loose loose stone. This is loose wood this time is by the church over here Let me actually think Eight. No, I know of nine. Sorry, I know of nine locations, so there has to be a tenth. There has to be a tenth I just haven't found yet. But let's grab the third wood spot. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. But uh, the third loose loose uh, tile is... Sometimes there's an NPC here, so you have to be careful. But there's a loose panel right here. That's not bad. Um, so just be careful. The final thief stash number nine, uh, there might be more added on to the end if I find more, is back behind the bank. And it can be in this back corner. I think I actually have a video to put here, but it's in this back corner here. And that's number nine. Um, well, this is the ninth chest. Uh, it finally spawned. Uh, it has been probably at least a week and a half since um i started the video to show off at well, least the that one. every chest can spawn this one just doesn't yeah. like spawning at all i'm out, very surprised it actually did spawn but uh this is the ninth and final chest i haven't found any more chests in that week and a half um there might not be any more but there's at least nine chests and three fake walls so just be careful of the npc he you know, walk around this area a little bit otherwise that is the ninth and final one. I'll do an outro later uh, just because I might find another um, treasure or wall. So yeah, there's there's the nine I know so far. It might be ten here shortly, but I'm guessing there's ten. And there's probably another loose uh, panel somewhere that I haven't found yet. Otherwise, I will see you when we find more. Or I'll see you guys for the outro. Okay, well... Hope you guys did enjoy the video. Um, there will be more videos to come out of Elder Scrolls Online. Uh, you just have to give me time. Um, because I have my plate really full at this moment. I have so much DLC and games I need to complete. And then there's anime and manga I have to review. Um, so there's still a lot for me to do before I could probably pick this back up and actually fully grind for a Kavach video. And like I said... Uh, that one, I think chest number nine for it to spawn 
uh, the Trove number nine. It took a week and a half for it to spawn, uh, to finally spawn, just to show it off for you guys. Um, so yeah, uh, some of these videos will take some time. Otherwise, we will eventually come back and do Kvatch or do other uh, small videos just showing off stuff in this game. Uh, stuff that I farm for or how I farm for supplies. And it might not be the best way, but it's the way I've been doing farming. And I know if I do a video like that, the first comment is going to be like, Oh, that's not the efficient way of doing it. You're doing it the slow way. We're supposed to do it this way or you're supposed to do it that way. Um, but I don't care. It's my way of farming. Um, so, yeah. Uh, hope you guys did enjoy the video. Uh, when we hit 2,000 subscribers, we'll be doing two gift card giveaways. Um, Otherwise, uh, yeah, I'll eventually be back to this game, but I have a lot of games to cover. This was just one of them I wanted to do because I don't see a lot of people go for the Thieves stashes in Anvil. And I wanted to make a video showing it off. I know a lot more people will be using these spots now from this point on. But um, since I took the time and research to just patrol this area and farm constantly, just Thieves stashes and pickpocketing people... I thought I might as well use the information and help you guys out. Otherwise, really, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully, I do see you guys in the next video. At the end, I'm going to put in, I think at the top will be uh, Best for the Viewer, which will give you a random video on the channel uh, that you can go watch. Or uh, down below, I think I'll just link it. I have an Elder Scrolls online playthrough. Is back when the game came out, and I put a ton of hours into it. Uh, but it's before I actually had a PC. It was still back on a laptop. And it's probably really bad quality. But um, it's a playlist that I'll keep on the channel. Because it marks my early days of YouTube. Uh, so I'll probably put that playlist down below that. Otherwise, really, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, hopefully this helps you guys out. And hopefully I see more people using the Thief Stashes. Otherwise... Um, this has been Mr. Crazy Deacon. I'm gonna run over here. If this number nine is here, I'm gonna be freaking pissed. Oh, it's not here. Yeah, this one has the worst spawn rate. Of all nine, this one spawns the least. Uh, otherwise, really, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully, I do see you guys in the next video. And, uh, peace.